Good morning. It's March 18th and we interrupt our regularly scheduled program for a book fair update and a book bracket challenge update. Stay tuned. What's for lunch today? Beef taco. And tomorrow is Bosco cheese sticks. Book fair. Book fair. Oh my. Excuse me, I didn't realize that I had company. Ha, ah, yes. Well, my name is Ignatius. Now that you are here, I just have to show you something. Come with me! Do you see all of these books? Books are my favorite. So there is this magical place called the Scholastic Book Fair. Can you imagine? A fair where they have books? Could anything be more fun? <laughs> I actually wrote a poem about it once. You'd like to hear it? Well... <clears throat> I wait and wait and wait. The Scholastic Book Fair is coming and it's great, great, great. Stacks of the best books for kids, you see. Brought to school for me, me, me. The Book Fair is coming. Yay! Yippee! Well, it sounds like it's time for me to go for now. But don't forget about the book fair! It's coming up soon, and it's going to be wonderful! The Scholastic Book Fair starts Monday, and you can shop at home, and all books will be shipped to your house as soon as the book fair concludes. Shopping will begin on Monday, March 22nd, and will continue until April 4th. More info to come next week. Welcome to round two of our Book Bracket Challenge. So, our first two books that were competing were Alma and How She Got Her Name versus I Am Every Good Thing. And we see that Alma and How She Got Her Name advances to the next round. The Case of the Stinky Stench, versus another monster at the end of this book. And moving forward is another monster at the end of this book. The true story of the three little pigs versus green eggs and ham. And moving to the next round is green eggs and ham. And finally, Harry the Dirty Dog and the book with no pictures. Moving forward is the book with no pictures. So now, it's time to vote in round two. Which books, you can only vote for two books. You have to decide which two books are gonna advance to the championship round. Click on the blue letters at the bottom where it says click here to vote. When you click there, it will take you to your own ballot and it will let you vote for bracket one, either Alma or another monster at the end of this book, or bracket two, green eggs and ham, or the book with no pictures. Once you cast your votes, click submit and tune in to DBN next week to find out who's going to the championship round. Our daily wonder quote for March 18th is, be the person who can smile on the worst day. Kate. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and our Habits Pledge after the joke of the day. What do you call a hat that follows you everywhere you go? A stocking cap. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I decide. On this day, to live the habits in every way. Be proactive. Begin with the end in mind. And always remember to be kind. Put first things first. Think win-win too. I can do this all, all day, day through. through. 
Seek first to understand. Then to be understood. That will help us. Synergize. It will feel so good. Sharpen the saw. A little every day. I'll live the habits. In my own way. <laughs>